Hey everyone, welcome back to Homes on Wheels. We have a really nice single wide home today to show you guys. And we're gonna take this mobile home tour together. This is under $100,000 and almost 1,200 square feet. And it's got features that you normally only see in homes twice this uh, price. Let's go in and take a look. And we're gonna put the floor plan right up here right now. As we go in, you'll notice this beautiful home. Love what they've done with the hardwood. And you've got an island in here, and you've got a fireplace. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They've got a fireplace, a big fireplace, and a single wide. I'll tell you guys, I'm liking what I see so far. Now this is one of the electric fireplaces, but I prefer that. And you've got the place for the big screen TV. That's a must. Got the hookups already there. Ceiling fan overhead. It's that modern style ceiling fan. I like those. We're going to pan back around and notice these two windows here. And you've got the patio door on the back. As well as two more windows on the side. And now Dave, who's going along with us, uh, has pointed out some things to us. These are real wood real wood cabinets and something you don't see a lot is soft close check this out soft close cabinets in a single wide this is not a double wide i know you're expecting me to say double wide it's not it's a single wide plenty of storage here in the island and then you've got your sink and everything now this doesn't have the pull down sink but it it's still a nice sink you guys know I like to pull down, but that's, there's nothing wrong with that. You could upgrade that if you wanted to. Got your dishwasher included here. You've got plenty of storage underneath. Close to your stove. Microwave over your stove. And more cabinets. And I know a lot of you guys that cook a lot always want a window that opens over in your kitchen area, and that one does. All right, so we're gonna pan back around now. This would be your dining area is what we're panning into here. And you've got some storage over there for plates or whatnot that you wanna display. Your fine china, if you will, as my grandmother used to call it. And more storage right there. So we're gonna pan back over and take a look into the laundry room. And it is right off of the kitchen here. It does have a door to close it, so if you guys are like me and let the laundry monster grow, you need a way to shut it off, you got it. You got that door there. And you've got the window overhead for your natural lighting. There is room in here for your washer and dryer, full size, no less. I don't see room enough for a uh, freezer in here, but for the price, you can't beat it. All right, so we're gonna go back over to check out the guest rooms and you guys know we always save the best for last there is a nice master bath in there in that master bedroom that i've only seen features in high-end double wides and when you guys see that you're gonna be in, you're gonna be in awe too so we're walking back through the hallway you've got your window here in the hall for your natural lighting again and then we're going to turn back immediately to the left and there is your first guest bedroom that you come to there's plenty of enough room in here for a standard size bed or a single bed if you want, a twin bed if you will. Be perfect for a kid or if you have an office and you want your little home office here, you got it. And we're going to check out the closet space in here. Now the AC and the heating and air is in the uh, floor also. The no wire shelvings and this is a single wide but no wire shelving. So this, you can tell this is an upgraded model here, but not at the upgraded price. So we're gonna go back and go on back down and we're gonna turn back. It looks like the heating and air is here in the hallway. There's your return for it. We're gonna go into the second guest room. This one looks a little bit bigger. Uh, it could be an optical illusion, but I think it's a little bit bigger. I'll put the specs in here so you guys know. And it has a window on the end. And if you notice at the beginning of the video, it has shutters, these nice looking shutters on either side of the windows. I really like that too. Of course, you can't see it from the inside. 
And we're going to go in and take a look at this uh, closet here. It's a standard size closet, nothing wrong with that, but again, you've got the standard shelving, not the wire stuff. I know you guys like that. We're going to go in. Oh, and check this out. I like this too. The rocker panel switches for the heat, for the lights there. And we're going to step into the guest bathroom here. It's a little dark. They don't have the power on. That's okay. You got the single sink. And you got your commode area, and then you've got the tub and shower combo there. There's no window in here, but there is an exhaust fan up there. So we're going to go back and show you guys that master bedroom. And I think you guys are going to be really impressed with that, as well as the master bath. That's, to me, I mean, this, this home is just quality, but that master bath is, oh man, I'm telling you. It's something to see. And so we're going to head back there right now. And then we'll talk about price here in a minute and surprise you guys with the price. So if you haven't liked the video, if you're getting value out of it, go ahead and hit the like button. Drop us a comment if you would. It helps us out. Keeps these videos for free as we do them just for you. And as you guys know, we are not salespeople. We are just average guys that go around and tour homes and, and give you our honest opinion on them. And I really like this one. Now, this is not the drywall in here, but uh, to keep the budget where you're at on it, I mean, it's pretty unheard of even though it doesn't have drywall. So There's plenty of space in here for a king size bed. Let's go in and take a look at the bathroom. Now, it's gonna be a little darker in here. I go ahead and apologize for that. But uh, we're gonna, we'll try to shine a light. And there's Dave, save with Dave in the shower. I caught him in the shower, guys. So we're going to pan back over here. And they don't have the mirrors up. Or, do these come with mirrors, Dave? No. Okay, they do come with mirrors, but the mirrors are not up yet. So again, no sneak peek. You know, guys, we like our sneak peeks, just saying. But you've got the two sinks in here in, in a single wide home. That's important. All right, so we're going to pan back over. You've got plenty of storage underneath there a lot of storage underneath there and then we're going to take a look and i'm going to show you this in the shower and this is what i think you're going to really like i've never seen it in any single wide ever there's your commode area a lot of arm room either side of the commode there we're used to seeing those little uh, water closets as some people call them uh, and uh, well then you got plenty of space there so dave's going to help me out and shine a light in here so that we can see inside this walk-in closet You've got plenty of space to the right, then you've got the shelving in there in the middle. And if you pan down there, you can see more shelving. And then we're gonna pan back over to the left, and you've got more shelving and more hanger space there. So now let's go in and take a look inside this shower. And Dave, I have never seen a single wide with this feature. First of all, this is not it, but first of all, real tile right there real tile you've got your step up you've got the uh and i don't even know what you call that where is this glass in the front i like that you only usually see that in higher end homes in the really nice three hundred thousand dollar double wides but here's another feature you don't see in single wide homes you just don't I, this is the first time i've ever seen this double shower heads You've got the rain head overhead right here with a control directly underneath it. You pan back over, you've got another shower outlet right there and another independent control. I think that is so cool. Not may not be a big deal to some of you, but it's a big deal to me. I like that. So now let's go talk about the price and you guys are going to be shocked. This is well under $100,000, well under $100,000. Like, so far under a hundred thousand if that was your budget you got plenty of space to work so dave i'm seeing it right now 89.9 yes sir is, you, that, is that right you're reading that correct 89.9 and this is september 2023 so, the prices are subject to change you know this is at the time of filming but i mean that's a lot of home that's a lot of home for 89.9 three bedroom two bath 11.85 on the square feet you got the model there, there, the ARC 8004. 
Dave, tell us just a little bit more about this home real quick. So this home is built by Sunshine Homes. <clears throat> They're built out of Red Bay, Alabama, which is over by the Mississippi line. Um, some of you might recognize the name Sunshine through the dog food manufacturer, um, Sunshine Dog Foods. And yes, they are related. Um, back in the 1930s, Sunshine Home or Sunshine Dog Food was a factory in Red Bay and they bought out a small mobile home dealer in the 1970s and they made that Sunshine Homes. Ever since then, um, 1971, to be precise, every home that they have shipped under the sink, they ship a small bag of Sunshine Dog Food. And that's with every home from single sections to multi-sections, um, no matter the price or the construction, every home will have a small bag of Sunshine Dog Food. Very cool. Dave, thanks a lot. If you guys haven't seen Dave on Facebook, if you're on Facebook, check out Save with Dave. Good guy. Thanks, Dave, for taking us on this tour today.